All right, now that we have gone through the body weight pretest, we're going to go ahead and get to play with some weight. We're going to start with the single kettlebell in our shin box switch with extension. We're going to hold it in the horn position. Forearms married to the sides of the kettlebell, elbows inside the thighs, knees up to the shoulders. You're going to initiate the movement by slowly dropping the knees off to one side. Again, trying to keep the hips down as low as possible and spine as straight as possible. From here, you're going to go ahead and initiate the movement by tucking your hips under and driving your hips forward. Core is engaged and you're really trying to tie your upper body and lower body together with that pelvic tilt. Sit back and down, slowly and steady. Exhale as you switch your knees back up and off to the opposite side. Sit nice and tall, drive your hips under and tuck as you push forward. Sit back and down, exhale, your knees back up to chest. I'm gonna go ahead and put the kettlebell down and Guy is gonna go ahead and demonstrate just a few more reps, slow and steady at first. Off to the one side, tucking the hips under as he extends, avoiding arching the back, so even tightening tighter here. Now sit back and down, exhale as he switches, and off to the other side. Elbows stay in, and he's going to tuck. So here, guy, we want to tuck the hips under a little bit more to make sure that we really avoid arching the lower back. Back and down, and now guy's going to go ahead and pick up the pace just for a couple of reps. Slow and st so steady he's gone. We're going to go ahead and pick up the pace and go a little bit faster. Good. Make sure you're matching your breath with your effort. Great job. Great job, guys. This is your shin box switch with the kettlebell and horn position.